Charlotte has a long tradition of knocking down historic places all over the Queen City, but one iconic watering hole has stood the test of time. Queen City News reporter Maureen Wirtz is in Plaza Midwood, where the Thirsty Beaver is celebrating 15 years. Piled together underneath the bar. Got another one from across the street. Is a stack of four by six. This is, <laughs> this is, a, this is kind of, I guess, a protest. Snapshots. One of those things where it's gone so quickly yet so slow at the same time. 15 years of memories. Some hung on the walls, but most are shared over a cold beer and a bar stool. Really, when we first opened, we didn't have any real set expectations um, other than just kind of being a neighborhood bar. Mark Williams and his brother Brian opened the Thirsty Beaver Saloon 15 years ago. At the time, they didn't know their bar would become a one-story symbol of rebellion, of standing up to the man. And I think that's part of why people are so attached to this place is because it did happen organically. It wasn't something that we forced or tried to push. As Plaza Midwood started to grow, a developer who owned the land around the bar wanted them out. Probably the most tense time, you know, there was this period of probably six months or so that was really like, we weren't too sure. In 2013, the developer went so far as to install a chain link fence all around the bar, just a few feet away from their building. I showed up and they, they were putting the poles in uh, and I was like, oh boy. But they won in the end. The apartments built up all around their little neighborhood watering hole. So now, actually, that's one of their selling points <laughs> is, 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 you know, you got your own bar right downstairs. The bar has become a local legend. Its story only getting grander with time, with one of the most famous rock stars in the world swinging by for a cold one. To where, yeah, someone like Mick Jagger can roll in and basically go unnoticed and just he's just another guy and just hanging out and, hey, we're all we're all the same. <laughs> Their goal all those years ago was to create a spot for everyone, and they didn't need to dream big to do it. That was Marine Words reporting. It's a pretty cool place, too. Big celebration starts tomorrow, but in thirsty beaver style. It's all about music, beer, and getting together with friends who have become family.